living in a in a house like this with natural living materials and putting living food in your body like you can't do nothing better for yourself it's just a perfect combo what's up y'all it's your boy Yakub aka Kuba from sustainability starts within and we out here in Mississauga my hometown just outside Toronto at a straw bale home you can see it behind me it's a beautiful natural straw bale home which is basically a home where the walls are insulated with straw bales so like straw that comes in bales from the farms stack them in place put plaster over it this is a clay plaster there's different kinds of plasters but this house is pretty natural you can tell and the clay just holds it in place really tight like rock solid structure and uh, you got some thick walls that have really good insulation value like R40 something like really high way past the building code standards and I just wanted to to talk about it a little bit because it's my original passion you know uh, my channel I got a lot of you can see my passion on raw foods obviously and the lifestyle of living healthfully and this was my original passion before raw foods took over the last few years because I really got into health and I was really like struggling with it for a while and now I got things flowing and I'm going back into like my original passion of sustainable building and natural building and fusioning the two together because it goes so hand in hand like living in a in a house like this with natural living materials and putting living food in your body like you can't do nothing better for yourself it's just the perfect combo so these walls are designed to basically allow moisture flow because there's no there's no vapor barrier there's no air barriers there's no plastic and, and weird materials and fiberglass and all this toxic stuff and things that keep air in your house kind of trapped here you got fresh air, air exchange and moisture flows through the walls so wherever it's less humid the moisture will go to so like you'll keep cool inside the house on a hot summer day just because the insulation is so thick and the, and the moisture just like travels through the walls so you don't have any like mold problems or anything like that and you don't have to worry about keeping moisture out and all that stuff because it's just like the walls some people call it the walls are breathing but it's not really breathing because it's not like air flows through it it just like the moisture travels through it and yeah so that way in your house you have a fresh air exchange and you don't have to seal your house in plastic and your building materials are non-toxic because it's just clay and straw like straight from the earth so I love like when I'm working building straw bale houses I'm just like I could rub the clay on my face and I I don't have to worry about toxins you know so there's lots of different natural building materials and methods out there there's hemp there's earth like straight up dirt there's um, earth bag where you put like sand in bags there's so many different things cob but straw bale is a good one in Canada because it's pretty cold here and it's really good insulation and I just wanted to you know give you a little bit of knowledge on that there's a lot of information a lot of te technical stuff scientific stuff but what if my house burns down if you look at the wall it's rock solid you're not gonna burn this down this is like rock how are you gonna burn it down you know just like any house houses are made with a lot of wood like any house can burn down if you set it on fire but the the resistance there's actually a lot of tests that have been done it's very fire resistant and it's just good and all around man that's why I was so passionate about it so now it's like with raw living building materials and raw living food I got the best of both worlds I can live in a healthy home and have a healthy body and just thrive in this life you know so it's beautiful amazing stuff and if you're interested let me know comment below thumbs up if you like it and uh, if you want me to share more info and stuff about this I just want to do a short video for now peace out
This is a beautiful home. Got some natural logs in here. This wood beams and just this straw bale and clay. You can see the straw bale here in the wall. They got it open. A lot of straw bale home client, uh, homeowners do this where they leave a little section exposed so people can kind of see the straw. It's just basically straw on the walls and then clay plaster finish on the end. You can round it off. And that's the perfect combo. Eating living alive foods to make your body just feel alive and being surrounded by alive natural materials in your home so you're not breathing in toxins and you're just breathing in life fresh air